Thank you, Foggy. Good afternoon, everybody. It's an honor to be here today, and I'll tell you, the snow certainly didn't keep anybody home. What a great cow. And I'll tell you, I understand that we have a few friends that are with us today, that it's the first time that they enjoyed enchiladas. So I'll tell you, it's always an honor to be able to share a little bit of home with some of our friends and family that travel from so many miles away. You know, we're, we're honored today that we have a very special guest. A very special guest that traveled many, many miles to be able to come and share a message with us and talk about the importance of truly putting people first, of making sure that we're working with leaders that care about people but that will put people first. And someone that I've admired for so many years, someone that I've looked up to, um, conversations that I was having in the back with a few friends about someone that we aspire to be like. And when we talk about Dolores Huerta and what she truly means to working people, hardworking people, people that many, many years ago and still across parts of the country today are still victimized in the workplace people that are taking advantage of. And to make sure that we're truly standing by this notion of making sure that we can organize, that we can make sure that our workplaces are safer, that we can act, that we can talk about and we can make sure we're fighting for fair wages. That's what she embodies. She has a flame that's inside of her that can never be put out. She's a woman that we admire so very much, and it's very special that she came here today to talk a little bit about the mayor. You know, as I've been traveling around the room today and walking around, there's been so many questions about health care. Don't give up is what I've been hearing. Yes. Fight for the public. 